damn it. What about these ones? No, those are number 30s. They're way too big. I need number 12. Can't you just drink from this pot? I only made it 20 minutes ago. A new Omni Bean Javatorium's opened up down the street. I need fresh coffee or I'm gonna lose all my late night customers. I need fresh coffee to prepare for my GED. You getting a GED? Yeah, some immigration guys came by my office and now I have to get a GED. You have an office? Okay, well maybe it's not an office, all right? But I got some rooms, some computers, sanitary throw rugs, some marketing divisions. Sanitary throw rugs? I don't want to hear it, Barry. The doctor's out. Doctor? What are you talking about? Aren't you listening? My GED, my German Excellency Doctorate. A GED stands for Graduation Equivalency Diploma. For high school, GED. I'm not a dog. You don't have to spell words in front of me. Sausage? What? I said sausage? What are you doing? I'm trying to give my delicious wieners to the world. You can't sell sausages in here. We sell sausages. If you sell sausages, that's a conflict of interest. The only conflict of interest is you not finding those coffee filters. Yeah. How is that a conflict of interest? Do you know what reduces conflict? Candace Worst Links. Their unique smoky flavor is proven to make even the bitterest of enemies the best of friends. You can't sell sausages here. Don't worry. I don't sell any sausages here that in any way resemble the sausages you sell except for some similarities in shape, price, and taste. Maybe these sausages will help you find the coffee filters sooner. No, they won't. Actually, Candace Worst Links are proven to increase visual acuity by 30%. My visual acuity is fine. Oh, really? I don't want your ear sausage, Candace. You had that sausage in your ear the whole time? Yeah, Roland, it's slight as sausage. Hey, that's AAA property. Besides, no one's ever noticed that attention-getting wiener balloon and decided to come in here and taste the wieners. Pardon me, but I couldn't help notice that attention-getting wiener balloon, so I decided to come in and taste the wieners. Candace? Ever have one of those days where nothing goes right? Where everything and everyone stresses you out? And you're the nexus of space and time? Well, Eagle Age Life, a variety store. These are the things that make me roar. Disco sucks and so does war. The meek shall inherit the earth no more. I am the king, I am therefore. What kind of a fool am I? Our legal age life a variety store These are the things that make me roar I am the king, I am therefore What kind of a fool am I? What kind of a fool am I? What kind of a fool am I? These are delicious. What's in them? Ancient family secret. Freeze. Hey, Pablo. Hi, Erica. We got a call about sausages. Illegal sausages. There's nothing illegal in my sausage. Do you have a 27B stroke 6? Of course. And, uh... TTK313B? Goes without saying. Various spices. Grease. Pig fat. Traces of rat product. Rat product? It's within legal limits. Delicious. Owl pellets. Sawdust. The extra ingredient is love. <laughs> no, that's not it. What does love smell like, I wonder? Carpet cleaner. Now can we please get back to looking for the coffee filters? <coughs> I smell tit mice. <laughs> Sir, tit mice are no laughing matter. Eating tit mice is against the law. Tit mice. Sexy. The 1941 German Titmouse Wiener Convention strictly forbids this type of despicable sausage stuffing. You have one hour to remove said titmice or we're gonna shut down this whole store. But, but he doesn't even work here! Uh-huh, uh-huh. We're on our way. Come on, we have a 213 in progress. Sausage party? Affirmative. Let's roll. Let's sausage roll. Hmm. Hour. I need a burrito. Just get them out of here! Can we start looking for those filters now? 
They'll be out of here soon enough. At a buck forty a pop, it can't go wrong. I just need to find a way around the German titmouse wiener convention. I'll do it myself. Hey! Get out of the cupboard! Germany? All right! Do you have any coffee filters? I, I just want to be alone right now. <laughs> Wait a second! I know you! You're the guy who invented the German Excellency Doctrine! Excellency? I'm getting mine tonight. What are you talking about? Right, you don't invent that for four more years. You know what? Forget I said anything. Never happened. Hey. Turn that frown upside down. A smile like that, you can take on the world. I'm supposed to be out with the girl of my dreams right now, but look at me. You're scared? No. Of a girl? No, I have poop on me. <laughs> That's rich. There's nothing to be scared of. You just march right over there, you be your excellent German doctor self, and then you charge your 300 Deutschmarks for services rendered. What are you talking about? Come on. What's your name again? Strauss, Beethoven, Wagner. You like Wagner? Oh, I like Wagner. I mean, I was into Wagner before anyone. <laughs> hey, do you guys know where I can get a good cup of coffee? Oh. That pot's a little stale. Hey, you don't have to persecute me just because I dress a little different, man. I was just looking. Persecute? Yeah. You know, I could have a lot of money. I could be the best customer you have all night. Uh-huh. Barry, a little focus, please. We're going to need some kind of powerful lawyer if we're going to get around this wiener legislation. What do you mean, we? You're going to prison in 45 minutes unless you can get those wieners out of here. I got headaches, Barry. I'm going nowhere until I get a fresh cup of coffee. You're gonna have all the coffee you want. In jail? Boy, if it isn't you, it's Germany. What? What? Can I help you? I'm okay. Okay, then. Is that coffee ready yet? Oh, I still can't find the filters. Why are you reading that stupid book when you could be looking for filters? It's not a stupid book, Roland. It's the Triple Eight Policy Finder. And I'm reading it to see whether or not I'm allowed to requisition floor filters and use them for making coffee. You have floor filters for sale? Why don't you say so? Whoa, 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 whoa! Roland, I can't use those now. Well, why not? Because they're spoiled merchandise. I have to return it to the supplier. I think you can make an exception for me. I am an excellent German doctor. A what? An excellent German doctor. No, you aren't. I will be. I just bumped into the founder of the GED, and he told me to take what I want, when I want it. You're taking high school equivalency? That's so unlike you. That's not what GED means. Why would Adolf Schickelgruber invent high school? <laughs> Did you say Schickelgruber? Don't make fun. He's a sweetheart. I don't think you know who you were talking to. Of course I do. Adolf Schickelgruber. I bumped into him back in 1929. It's four years before he invents the GED. You know, Schickelgruber is the name Hitler used to use before his overbearing father reclaimed him. Wow, thanks, History Channel. It's interesting. Anyway, who the hell is Adolf Hitler? <laughs> yeah, that plot's a little stale. Did you say Hitler? Yeah, don't worry. I put him on the right path. <laughs> on the right path? You're talking about Adolf Hitler, the most notorious evildoer of the 20th century. That might be true. Only my Adolf Hitler isn't an evildoer. He's a good doer. Short guy, Charlie Chaplin mustache? Yeah, that's the guy. Yeah, evil. Charlie Chaplin's evil? That's not what I'm <laughs> saying. Roland, Hitler's responsible for millions of needless deaths. And that's not even the worst part. Yes, it is. He was the leader of Nazi Germany. What's worse than that? Okay, true. 
But also, he single-handedly destroyed the German Titmouse Wiener tradition by enacting the 1941 German Titmouse Wiener Convention. Well, it's true. This is no time for jokes, Candace. I'm not joking! It all goes back to the mid-30s. Hitler and Winston Churchill had a secret meeting to keep peace through Europe. Everything was fine until... Have a sausage. No, thank you. I'm vegetarian. Try one. They're made with tit mites. I don't eat meat. Hitler took the whole thing personally and swore to make his first act of war to deny the delicious taste of titmouse to the world. And for that, he should burn. Are you kidding me? I can't believe I'm hearing this. You people are sick! Titmice? GED? The man was a murderer! A cold-blooded murderer! Murderer! Cold-blooded! And you! You work for the man! Jakku! Oh boy. What is he talking about? Hitler's one of the nicest already dead guys I've ever met. How many already dead guys have you met? Three, and only one of them have ever invented the GED. Well, I'm sorry, but the man has got to be stopped. The future of Candace Worst Links depends on it. What about the GED? Oh, shut up. There's no such thing as the German Excellency Doctorate. Then explain this. Damn it! Guys, I'm gonna need to find some number 12 filters or I'm gonna be screwed. The late night student coffee crowd is gonna be here any minute. Don't worry. If I go back in time, kill Hitler, prevent the GTM, WC, and WW2, there'll be no pesky health legislation to hold back my meat. Right, but there'd be no GED. Or World War II. That little thing would be gone too. That'd be okay. I never saw the first one. I'm going back. My sausages need me. You still couldn't sell them at the Triple Eight. In theory, I could. In theory, you could do a lot of things. Yeah, like teleport. You can't teleport in theory. I'm saying in theory. Yeah, but there's no theory. You can't do anything in theory without a theory. You know, it's exactly that kind of thinking that holds back the electric car. No one's holding back the electric car. I saw one this afternoon. Right. You saw an electric car flying in the sky using light for fuel. I never said it flew. And if it was using light for fuel, that would make it solar powered, not electric. Solar powered? That'll be the day. Can you imagine a car that can harness the power of the sun? They have those too. Don't change your story. I'm not changing my story. Yes, you are. One minute you're on. I'm going to go kill Hitler. The next thing, Hitler invented the solar-powered car. He didn't. He invented the Volkswagen. Ha-ha! Damn it! Damn it, I need to make this coffee now. Would you guys get the hell out of here? Fine, I got to go kill Hitler anyway. I'm coming with you. No, no way. You'll screw it up. I'll screw you up. Hey, where's the damn coffee? Guys, I need coffee now. It's not fair, man. Me. Students rely Bring upon AAA me. coffee. And we will Bring protest until there's fresh me. coffee in that Bring coffee pot. One, two, One, two three, three, four. Fill that pot, you corporate whore. One, right, two, I understand three, that. Four. I'm trying to make Fill a fresh pot, but you won't let me near the machine. One, two, That's because we can't three, let you cross four. our Fill picket line. Pot, you corporate two, four, four six, six, eight. Fill that pot up perfectly. That doesn't make sense. How do you expect there to be a fresh pot when you won't let me make it? That's not my problem, man. Down with the man. Down with the man. This is ridiculous. Down with the man. 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 Well, this is the place. We came back here for some veggie schnitzel and to look at his crappy art. Shh. Wait outside. Can't you just talk to him first? I don't think so. He's a vegetarian. He wouldn't understand. Hey, wait a minute, I'm a vegetarian. Are you saying I don't understand? You don't understand. That's not the point, Candace. It's exactly the point, Nimrod. Now keep quiet or you'll wake him up. No way! Hey, a David Hasselhoff record. David Hasselhoff? Like I rock! Hey, headphones and a phonograph. <laughs> All right! <clears throat> Jackass. <laughs> there? What the? Uh, you guys poop 
on me. Who are you? Sorry. It's okay. I, I, I deserve it. It's Eva. She says I'm a nothing, a nobody, a, a mediocre artist with no future. Oh, it hurts. Oh. Well, relax, buddy. Uh, everyone's got a future, while well, yours is crazy. <laughs> you know what they say, you can't have too much titmouse in the wiener. What? Well, it loses something in translation. Yeah. I, I, I'm being pathetic. You know, but but no more. I am I am I am strong now. You know, Mark Schnell. Oh, <laughs> just don't get carried away, except with regard to sausages. No, no, I am I am going to go over there and I'm going to tell her how I feel about her, and then she will be Miss Schickel Gruber, and I can wear my name with pride. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Good one. <laughs> Good night, you two. <laughs> Who knew Hitler could be so slippery? <laughs> Come on. Will you listen to that? It's all like to dean it, to dean it, da 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 dean it. It's amazing. Hasselhoff. Whatever. I couldn't kill him. Wrong Hitler, huh? No. God, read a book. And now, with a KQRY exclusive, here's Barry, the clerk who refuses to boil the bean. Barry? Refuse? I've got the filter right here. What is it about the students that makes you so aggressive? I'm not aggressive. I'm accommodating. <laughs> How'd it go? Coffee ready? Guess he didn't kill him, man. No. He spilled crap on himself, and then he was crying, and I felt sorry for him, and then he told me he was a virgin, and that capped it. Hitler's a virgin? Well, not anymore. I took care of it. You slept with Hitler? Oh. Don't say that. That's uber creepy. Yeah, revolting. I gotta find a different way to do him in. I need a burrito. Uh, what's with the hippies? It's a sit-in. Hey, is that a coffee filter? Yeah. So why isn't there any coffee? The sit-in. I can't get to the machine. Why don't you just call the cops and arrest them for trespassing? And lose all that business? Are you nuts? Give me that. What's he doing? Students, hear me! Huh? I have here in my hand a coffee filter. Stolen from the regime! Yeah! Make way and I'll brew some of the most rebellious coffee this store has ever seen! Yeah. Woo! Woo Excellent. I hear he was a doctor. Hey, this is a decaf filter. A filter's a filter, Roland. There's no such thing as a decaf filter. <clears throat> Damn it! What are you doing to us? Yeah, decaf coffee is for suckers with heart problems. Wait, I've got some regular ones somewhere. Just don't go anywhere! Ah, the sweet smell of opportunity. Hello, unruly students. Don't let this corporate lackey oppress you. I heard there's a new Omnibean Javatorium, hmm? Magazines, lots of comfortable seating, not like this joint. Who are you? Me? I'm um, nobody. I'm just some lady. More likely you're a tool for the man. Tool for the man! Tool oh, for no, the man! Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Time's up. You're coming downtown. With us. In chains. On what charge? Sausage proliferation. Illegal sausage proliferation. These sausages are illegal? They were illegal. I guess they're just a memory now. Mm. Tastiest memory I ever had. <laughs> we have proof. What proof? He's got us there. That was close. I guess you don't have to go back and kill Adolf Schickelgruber after all. If we wait exactly 20 minutes and 16 seconds, we'll arrive at the precise moment he decides to deny the delicious taste of titmice to the world! All right, kids, I'm gonna level with you. I'm a representative of the Omni Bean Corporation and I have been authorized to present you with these buy nine, get one free card. Free? That's right, free. But you have to buy nine $12 cups first. Yeah. Our coffee's only 49 cents. The 10th one isn't $12. Roland?
Yeah, no, the dense one. Dog tags are so smart. So does the Omni Bean Jabatorium provide free sausages? Does this place provide free cream and sugar? Hear that, Mussolini? Free cream and sugar. Mussolini? We offer free cream and sugar. And, and they offer free sausages. No, they don't. Face it, Barry. Your empire is over. What empire? Exactly. Are you coming? No, I'll stay here and make sure this evil dictator doesn't rise again. He's so brave. Hmm. An eye-catching wiener balloon. Good idea. Yoink. Excuse me. That's AAA property. Thanks a lot, Roland. You're welcome, Barry. That's the kind of behavior you can expect from an excellent German doctor. You're not an excellent German doctor. I will be. I just need a fresh pot of coffee. Sorry I'm late. My van broke down and I had to borrow my mom's old Volkswagen to finish my rounds. Volkswagen? Hitler's disturbing legacy haunts us once again. Candace, it pains me to say so, but you need to let Hitler live. Uh, a sign here. Why? If you kill Hitler, there'll be no Volkswagen. No Volkswagen means no coffee filters. Mm, I do want coffee. All's well that ends well. Don't you have somewhere to be? Yeah, I'm supposed to be at my GED test right now. Then shouldn't you be going? Excellent German doctors are never exactly on time. Hmm. I gotta go. Hey, how'd it go? What a bunch of idiots. <laughs> Not quite what you expected, was it? Not at all. First of all, they were mad at me because I was late, which makes no sense. Then they put me in this big room and had paper and pencils and started asking all these questions. Then I find out we're not even allowed to talk to each other to find out the answers. So what happened? Well, I showed them my passport and they gave me these. <laughs> they gave you a diploma? It's a doctorate, dummy. Now I can perform heart surgery anytime I feel like it. Not here in the store. Anytime I feel like it!